How to fix when Windows 10 is unable to record sound? Well, this is the tutorial for you. Ok, so your Windows doesn't allow you to record a sound. Well, usually the problem is quite simple. Usually you just need to go to the settings. Just open the settings application. In the settings menu you find the privacy tab. When you go to the privacy tab you need to go to the microphone. Here under microphone you can see allow apps to access your microphone. If these uh, settings are off allow desktop apps and allow apps to access the microphone then applications like Audacity or Skype won't have the ability, won't have the access, won't have the rights to use your microphone. So you need to keep these on and that should fix the problem for most people. However, we should dive a little deeper. So please click your Windows key and open the control panel that you can find most easily by search. In the control panel you have the sound tab. On the sound tab we have recording. And on recording we can see we have different microphones here. Now what you need to do is you need to right click and make sure that show disabled devices and show disconnected devices are checked. Then you can activate you can see this, we can disable it, we can right click it again and we can enable it. Now you can basically tap the different microphones you have here to see which one you want to use. If you have an external microphone it's usually the best microphone which is the one I use now. Then you can go into the microphone you want to use and go to properties. Then you can go to levels and here you can decrease this level and you can also increase it. If this is too high you might pick up background noise. Uh, so just click apply and close this down. However, let's pretend that this, we set this as the default device. And we right click and we go to properties and here you can also see the levels here. This one we have two different sliders, the microphone and the boost or side tone. The microphone first slider is the sensitivity. So if you are having a real problem to hear the sound you can use this one, this booster, to boost the sound so that you might hear yourself. If this first slider is too high you might pick up background noise. One thing that can be the problem here is that this little button is checked so that it's basically muted. When your microphone is muted you can obviously not use it. Sometimes the personal enhancements are problematic. Then you might check disable all sound effects and click apply. If that also didn't solve the issue for you you can do one more thing. You can click Windows key and X then you can get up device manager. Click on device manager. Inside the device manager we can find the sound, video and game controllers. Here we can find the different audios we use here. We have Realtek High Definition and we have Samsung Go. What we can do is we can try an updated driver. We can also disable this device and enable it again. So basically we can do with this one because this one I'm not using. We can disable it. Yes. And then we need to wait a little bit. And then you can see it's crossed there. So then we can use enable it. This you can do for all of these if you're not sure which one you are using. It doesn't hurt to disable and enable them. If the problem persists you can try and right click and uninstall device and then restart your computer. This might bring back the audio. When you restart the computer again you should have some default drivers. If that causes problem for you you can right click it again and you can click update a driver and you can click browse the computer for 
the drivers, let you pick from a list and choose high definition audio device drivers instead. Install that, restart the computer and see if that works. I hope this little video helped you with your microphone problems. And if it did, please leave a like. Do subscribe and I'll see you in future videos. You can also donate to the channel if you really want to help it. This is Jim Total Audio Channel, signing out.